munching on some reduced saturated fat sesame sticks. Mmm. Anyone notice in the vlog yesterday when I was talking about that, I said sesame seeds <laughs> because I was watching it back and Anna started laughing. She's like, you call them sesame seeds, not sesame sticks. <laughs> but no one left a comment, no one says anything. Normally you guys are more astute than that, okay? Pay attention, right? I'm going to purposely make a mistake today and I want you guys to pick up on it, okay? Do you ever notice how, isn't it funny how everybody knows how, why can't it be how? <laughs> Sometimes you start a block and you're like, what was I just saying? I lost my train of thought. But let me just pull this over. Oh, I've got darker, but now you can see what I'm talking about, right? So, due to peer pressure, I'm starting to create the uh, thingy bobbins, the title sequence for the vlog, right? Now, like, professionally, I do this stuff all the time, you know? I could whip this up in a day, you know, no problem for a client and stuff. But it's very different, isn't it, when you're making something for yourself? Because I'm sitting here and I've set up, like, uh, I was writing the script there for my camera track and stuff. And I was like, but what am I supposed to do? <laughs> you know? It's like, if you, if one of you were like, Mr. Dear Mr. Jerry, I'd like to cons to hire you as a consultant, as an audiovisual person, a little special effects supervisor for this particular production. Will you be available? I'll be like, yes sir, I'll be ready for right now. Mr. Jelly, we need an idea for this idea. I'm riveting full of ideas, mister. I'm a missed idea machine. And then I'd go and write a million things and script it and light it and film it and everything. And it'll be like awesomely amazing. But when you're sitting here and you got to do something for yourself, you're like, maybe, uh, will I just... Could I? Can I? Should I? Would I? What I coulda, can I shoulda, woulda, coulda, can I shoulda, woulda, coulda, can I shoulda, today, woulda, coulda, can I shoulda. <laughs> anyway, right, so this may not be on tomorrow's vlog, okay? Don't kill me. Don't hate the hater. 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 Don't hate me. But, you know, the pressure, the pressure. Probably gonna, I'm still probably going to get a hundred comments. Please put Cena in the intro. Cena so will be in the intro. I'm working on it, guys. It just, it takes a lot of time and it takes a lot of effort. And, you know, what I could do is I could sit here all day, right? And I could work in it. And there'd be no daily vlog. What do you think of that idea? I don't think you like that idea. I don't think you like that idea. So, I think we're going to go and get Albie and Cena a bed. Another bed. Because they're probably, yep, they just like to find my clothes. So, they're just like... Squiddle up there. <laughs> so, two beds that were there have been brought downstairs to the kitchenies because it's great when we say, that's where they go. Make sure no one heard that. That's where they go and they love it there and they always play together so we're like, like we need to get it. Plus, I want to get like a teeny little lead for uh, Cena so when we bring her for the, she, uh, she has a good time. I don't think people to hear me. Anyway, got to get back to work. I gotta get back to you. Oh yeah, did you guys check out my um, Jonathan Jolly channel? I start um, it's kind of like my um, my it's like a, like a di diary, dear diary. Today I did not eat a cow, for I am the cow and I grazed. Whoa, that's kind of deep because now I'm not eating and drinking from the cow. I'm becoming the cow because I'm eating like plant-based food. I'm grazing like I have become the cow. Whoa, whoa! Somebody call Freud. That stuff is so deep. Deep. But anyway, check it out. It's just like a diary thing on um, what it's been like so far. How I felt like. Have I increased my energy? Blah, blah, blah. Which I have, by the way, guys. Totally awesome. Woo -woo. Don't want to say too much. Check out the other channelies. Also, did you guys have a style life book yet? What's the delay? Leave me a comment if you bought a style life book, book and a book. And I will give you a high five. High five! It is so sunny today. It's so nice. It's like a perfect day to bring them out. Hopefully we get the lead though. I think you can get like really small leads for like really small dogs. I think seeing this like, I don't know, can you get puppy leads? I definitely we got a lead for Albie ages ago, which was like a really, really small one, which is kind of like a puppy one. So hopefully we can get a puppy one. We're going to that one on the corner, which a couple of you guys are like, oh, you should check out the little one by, uh, is this the Kinsale roundabout? No, it is the Kinsale Road roundabout. Yeah, but you know by the Kinsale Road roundabout behind Smith's or in front of Smith's, probably more. <laughs> Appropriately named. Now, if I can just get in my right lane here. Oh, look, Anna. Come here. This one. Look. Cena. Hold on, I need to pick her up. <laughs> Cena's going mental. She's just running around the place in here. She's having the time of her life. Woohoo! Come on. Look. Like, Calm down when I put her down. Like, this one. 
that's really big. So I think that one's better with the little you know. factors on it. It comes in big size too. Or maybe this one. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah, a little small one. I know. Remember, Alfie's is like 50. Here, look, find the lead thing first. That's more important. Yeah. Come on, Abby. Need to find her. What about one of these for Cena? Here. I think we need to get one of these. Yeah. You know, just to yeah. calm her down a bit. It's here. The problem is, I want to get that one because it's good, but it's that's too big Albie. for her. That's Cena. Is there a smaller uh, one? The, the, the yeah, non pull harness. Oh, that looks exactly. Oh, that is exactly. It good. is. It's it. It's it. Well, it's a small one, this one. Look. I know, but I wonder if. Does that say small? Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. So I put the battery in, in this thing, right? And you can actually see what happens. Look, when I turn it on. That's it. That's all it's going to do. But maybe something blocking it, so I'm gonna see if I can fix it, and then maybe I can give it to uh, give it to Nina to fix. You guys are the cutest little things in the world. Look at you. Oh, oh, did I disturb you? I didn't mean to. It's just you're so cute. I had to just show the guys. I had to show you guys how super cute she was. Oh, oh. I'm hungry. I don't know. I just wanted to share that with you. Are you guys hungry? Because I am surely hungry. Ich habe ein Hunger. Hunger has me. Hunger has me. I want to give hunger the heave ho. You know, in a normal situation, I could just go ahead and I could eat some lovely chicken calves. The mashed potato, but no, they have butter and milk and all sorts of things in them. So we're gonna go off to Tesco. We go today off to Tesco. We go merrily, 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 merrily. Life is but a dream. I've never taken this camera to Tesco. Whoa! This camera is gonna have a day view in Tesco. What are you guys thinking of? Are you guys excited? Are you excited? Are you excited? Are you excited? <laughs> Last two days we've been going to restaurants, so he's probably thinking, oh, here we go. This is becoming a new routine. No. Sina, into bed. In your bed, Sina. You have to be in your in bed, bed to get a treat. In your bed. Treats? In your bed. In, in, in. <laughs> sit. Sit. Good boy. Okay, guys. Can we go, guys, mind in the house? Good job. Okay, mind the house now. Oh, the food is here. Oh, you know they'll get it. Mind the house, guys. Mind the house. Good dogs. We're a loving couple on an afternoon walk oh, on a Saturday Sorry. night. Mm -hmm. This is what a loving couple do on an afternoon walk on a Saturday night. Turn! Turn! Car! Car! Game Ross. on! Say game on. Game on. Game on. Is that car coming towards us? Game oh on. no! Oh no! Who do you think would win in a running race from here to Tesco? I'm not prepared to run. Because. You ready? Are you steady? Stop! Okay, what about from here to that post? No. <laughs> Come on. From here to that post. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Ready? Are you gonna run? Yeah. Don't be a fucking liar. Look, it's getting closer. Yeah, exactly. So it's a now. Well, the first one to get that gets the treat. Get the treat in Tesco. Okay. Go. <laughs> Got it. I got it first. You run into it though. <laughs> Once I was holding my dad's hand when I was little, and she wasn't that little, I was like 9, 10 maybe, yeah. and um, <laughs> we were walking along and I was holding his hand, I was looking at something, and he kept walking because he thought I was like, oh, and you split? smashed into a pole, oh, no. like head on, and he was just like, oh my god, are you okay? He was just got such a fright, so I just went like completely whack, and I turned my head just as I did it. Oh, <laughs> Has that ever happened to you guys? Have you ever been intentionally or intentionally or intentionally? Intentionally or work? Can you intentionally do something? It's very sensitive. You want? Can I get one? For your candle. 
It's two feet. Oh. Oh, wait. That's 350. Mm, it is actually. Yeah, Tesco, what the hell is up with that like? It's very misleading with your advertisements. Now, uh, we're gonna need um, about a crate load of this stuff, I think. <laughs> Come on, let's go to the twigs. Let's go to the twigs and berries section. Somebody said that you can get dairy free cheese, remember? I don't know if you can here. One of those kind of special places. Yeah. What's in uh, the chocolate? That's all cheese based, isn't it? Yeah. Cheese, 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 cheese. Mm. Oh, maybe one of these ones. No. No, no you need to go to like a proper, a proper place. Give me a comment if you know the name of the uh, dairy free cheese. Oh my god, guys, look what I found. Look, potato casserole, free from everything. It's no dairy, gluten, or wheat or anything. Isn't that pretty awesome? There's like loads of ready made meals. That Tesco do now and they're free from range. So my worst fear was like, what am I gonna do in work during the day? Like how am I gonna not be able to eat like this kind of food? But like this might be the answer. And that's super cool. Do the time here we're doing is just buy one of things. Like if we find something that we actually think looks good, we're only gonna buy one of it. Just in case actually uh actually don't like it in the end, you know, so we don't wanna have like a ton of this food at home and then we actually don't like any of it. But guys like I can't believe how much stuff is here. Like look at all this stuff. Like this is just rows and rows of food. That's all like dairy free and everything. Fine dark chocolate. What's this? This is like the best oh my goodness, Jaffa cakes! You can have Jaffa cakes, you can have like cakes and sweets and this doesn't be this isn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Like there's loads and loads of food you can actually have. Can we figure out the day when we messed about? You don't need biscuits, right? They actually have um, no dairy whatsoever or anything in them. I went to look at to read the ingredients on this. Oh, right. Do you not speak squiggle? <laughs> no, there's another side, but I was just like, <laughs> you pull up that side first. <laughs> oh, Nina's gonna do it. Are you gonna do it? Are you? How is it? What flavor are you going for? This is just every root vegetable. Hey, in crisps, is there actually dairy in crisps? I don't know. Dried sour cream. Milk whey powder. Milk whey powder. Is that yeah, yeah. actual? Whey is like. Is milk. Is Aww. Dairy. Hummus. Red pepper pe oh, pesto. Hummus? Pesto hummus? Is it sometimes oh, pesto has. Um, no. Yeah, milk. What? What? Sesame. Like what what flavour is that? Olive. Olive and sun-dried tomato. Sea salt and cracked black pepper. I can't believe the red pepper and pesto one. That looks so good. And it's got dairy in it. These ones are fine. What is it? That's the plain one. Oh, like okay, what we okay, had. okay. And then that's olive and sun-dried tomato. Don't really like olive. Is there, is, see this one here? Look. Black pepper, sea salt yeah, and cracked black pepper. Is there a big one in that? No. Yeah, this though. This is the one that we got. Yeah, I just... Really? Yeah, because paste don't have... Alright, let's get this one. A leafy rocket. A leafy rocket. Could be a leafy rocket. I want to be a leafy rocket. Do I look like a healthy person? Walking along. <laughs> with my salad. Hello. I'm rocket. a healthy person. With my rocket salad. I'm taking my rocket home. On a rocket time. You want to see all the stuff like we bought? Like it was crazy. It was all like all natural preservatives and all like fresh but food it wasn't and that everything. Much, How much was it? Yeah, that's it. That's it. I don't know. It was like 30 euros or something. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. So for tonight, for my Saturday night fun time, I have organic dark chocolate. With mint milk. <laughs> With mint. With mint. mint fondant. With mon mint fondant. It's about the size of half of my finger. Then I've got a nutty, chewy, dry bar thing. I hey, have, but I figured out I could have peanuts, so that was good. What are you having? I got apricot, dried apricots. I got another raw, naked bar. And I got the root vegetable crisps. We are crazy. We are crazy, folks. We're going mental tonight. But I probably won't have all that tonight. But no, you wouldn't want to overdo no. it with the root vegetables. No. <laughs> you wouldn't want to eat too many root vegetables, that is. <laughs> Over here, we have on the hub this um, 
What is it? A potato and casserole. Chicken potato casserole. We free, gluten free, milk free. So let's see what this is like. You know, it could be really good. It says you can microwave it, but to maximize its taste texture, I'm going to put it in here. You can definitely see that, look, there's definitely less. Look, you can see there's no real sauce. You know, normally these things are covered in sauce. You can see there's hardly any sauce in it, but um, let's hope it's good, you know, because that was, I was really concerned about that. And I just ate a naked cashew cookie. Mmm, naked. We actually went to, if you guys check out the naked website. For yeah. Free. Yeah. Um, the girl, well, the girl, I don't know, a girl who, like, works for them. She saw my blog post on the vegan food haul, and she saw that I had mentioned the naked um, raw bars, and she said that there were a few new flavors that they had coming out and she wanted to send us some in bulk, like for free. So, yeah, to review on the on the vlog. Awesome! It's pretty cool. That's totally super but you can cool. buy them in bulk. I thought you couldn't, but you can from their website. But I don't know if they deliver to Ireland usually. Did we get no, no, or you just ate that one? Here's the, uh, here's my organic chocolate I was telling you about. 7% cocoa organic, I'll tell you what that's like later. And I also got myself a, uh, look at this, I think this is funny, right? It goes, macadamia's Brazilians and nothing dodgy. Isn't that funny? Eat natural. And then I got some uh, apricots. Apricot, I found it, you can eat these. Yum! I also love these, they're very tasty. Yeah, they're very tasty. <laughs> a bit chewy, good fiber, good source of fiber. And some root vegetables. It's all in all. Day three, is this day three? Yeah. Of our crazy diet? They treated a crazy diet. It's all right. I decided to mix some of the vegetable or the salad -y stuff with it, you know, just to see what it'll add a little something num nums. And then some of us are just chofus juice, chofus juice. Everybody wants to drink chofus juice. I have to admit it, guys. That was super good. That was super tasty. Yeah. Power to the people. Power to the chofus. Okay. So it turns out that a lot of the time when I was recording. I wasn't actually recording, so <laughs> I have to kind of get used to this camera because I was just looking through the footage there and I was like, uh oh, I <laughs> loads of like, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot, like, you know, you press record, and then I was like, alright, I think that's setting a focus, and then I press record, thus turning it off, and then start talking, so we kind of missed out on loads of footage, oops it ladies. So guys, this is, I got a new camera. I've noticed that none of the footage is explaining that I got a new camera and why I got a new camera. So this is the old camera that I used to have and as you can tell it's broken as you can see. Um, I put a, uh, an actual post up on Facebook. On the Facebook. If you're my friend, if you're friend on the Facebook. Between, that was the first camera I got for the vlogs which lasted like 100 days, then I got the Canon there which lasted 130 days and now we have the new Canon one there which is the new one that I have now. I do think that it's got a much better audio microphone on it. I think it's uh, there was always this like a uh, treble hiss that was always on the old vlogs that was on the other camera. I do think they've definitely improved the microphone. Um, the 14.1 the 14 .1 megapixels on the camera, I can't really see the benefit until tomorrow because I'll video in the daytime and have a look. At the moment, it's just going to be as dark and dreary. But I thought it was really funny that when I when I pulled all the footage in to start editing of the vlog, I was like, wait a minute, there's no explanation to what I'm doing with this new camera. Nor is there like bits, just massive chunks of the day just not there. But you know, you got to forgive me because the camera broke and we kind of lost all that footage. But you know... Follow me on Twitter or Facebook and I'll let you know next time the camera breaks and dies. Okay. <laughs> oh, the other thing is, you notice how wide this is like? See how much wider it is? That's kind of cool, isn't it? First thing I notice is the uh, the lens on it is a much more improved lens. So look how it's a nice wider shot, which is great. So we're not like so close to each other anymore. We're a little bit further away. Hey guys, can you hear me back there? <laughs>